All right, 519 on the clock. Let's head over to Matt over the Weather Center and uh, check out a beautiful forecast for today. It is morning lows. I mean, we're dropping in the low to mid 70s area wide for the valley. So feeling really nice this morning. We'll warm it back up closer to 98 as you get to the daytime high around 3, 4 o'clock. But right now your temperature in the mid to upper 70s in Las Vegas. Your dew point down about 31 degrees. So we are dealing with uh, just some dry conditions out there persisting for the rest of the week. We'll sneak back some of that monsoon moisture by Thursday and Friday, but until then it's looking very dry outside for Las Vegas and Southern Nevada. Out the door forecast. We have complete blue sky with more sunshine working its way back in low 70s through about 7 a.m. We'll work back closer to 80 by 8 and 9 o'clock and then approaching 90 by 11 a.m. But we are up to about 98 degrees for a daytime high today. It's feeling uh, really spectacular rolling off a somewhat calm and quiet, cool weekend. I know we had 92 degrees yesterday for a high temperature. Upper 60s in Centennial Hills, 74 degrees in Aliante, 76 degrees in Nellis Air Force Base, 75 for Boulder City this morning and looking at 57 degrees out in Pahrump this morning for a morning start. 24 hour temperature change, not a big difference, about four degrees cooler than this time yesterday in Henderson, but waking up to again, the low to mid 70s valley wide for us in Las Vegas. So feeling really nice with those blue skies returning and abundant sunshine in the forecast for your Monday. We'll be in the low 90s by one o'clock, looking at our daytime high closer to five o'clock at 98 degrees. So we'll sit at 95 for Indian Springs, 76 up in Mount Charleston, 97 at the Henderson Executive Airport, about 104 degrees in Laughlin and Bullhead City. That's typical though for this time of year. Averages right around 101 to 102. So we'll keep it seasonal for the next day or so. But this area of high pressure is going to allow us to warm up. It's going to hop in the driver's seat over the next few days. And that's what's going to bring us back closer to about 105 degrees as we transition into Labor Day weekend. Now we're seeing this low pressure moving over Idaho, but it's bringing a whole lot of rain into Colorado and New Mexico at this hour. But most of us are going to be staying dry over the next three days. By Thursday and Friday, we'll work back in some of that monsoon moisture. For tomorrow morning, lows still dropping into the 70s. So we'll feel some cooler mornings ahead. But for tomorrow, We'll keep the sunshine back 94 degrees by 11 a.m. A little bit warmer as we get into three o'clock on your Tuesday at 101. Your high temperature stalling about 103 in Las Vegas for tomorrow afternoon. Now I mentioned the monsoon moisture. We'll see signs of it working its way in by Wednesday afternoon. That's in the form of cloud cover. Not really getting much of that moisture just yet. By Thursday, there's a slight chance of a few showers. Looks mainly around the Colorado River and east into Mojave County, Arizona. But the clouds are definitely moving its, their way back in as we get into Wednesday and Thursday. Chance for showers. Models really not giving much to us heading into Thursday and Friday, but just a very slim chance of a few pop-up showers. Here you go. Monday morning drop-off, 80 degrees. We're near normal. Wind speeds 5 to 10, and then afternoon wind around 10 to 15. So just some lighter wind out there this, uh, this afternoon, your Monday. 98 degrees for an afternoon pickup and your next two weeks in calendar view on your school edition forecast. Slight chance for showers Thursday and Friday and then a windier Labor Day weekend. Monday looking breezy with some wind gusts around 20 to 30 miles per hour. Nothing too bad outside and here you go for your seven day forecast. We'll have conditions around 98 degrees on Monday, kicking it to 102 as we get into Tuesday and then from there temperatures continue to climb as we get into the rest of the work week 104 Thursday and 105 on Friday before we head into Labor Day weekend. Dave over to you.